And yet, Ms. Governor Huckabee, it's Michelle Caruso Cabrera here in, in New Jersey. At the same time, I read that you really want to lay a lot of the enforcement on when it comes to illegal immigration on employers. Isn't that adding more regulation to them in a country where they really need employees, especially with unemployment so low? No, the real key is getting government to get off its rear end and fix this problem, which they've neglected for all these 20 years since they did an amnesty program. The real challenge is seal the border, don't have an amnesty program, but have a, a system like we've proposed where people have to start over, get in the back of the line and come. But after you've done that, now if you still have employers who are uh, knowingly and willingly hiring people illegally to pay them under the table, yes, you should come after them because they're actually not just cheating uh, the people that might have those jobs, they're cheating all the rest of us taxpayers by not owning up to uh, their obligation to pay the same thing that their competitors are having to pay. You don't think restricting the flow of immigration into this country would hurt the economy, especially for the businesses out there that so desperately need those employees? It's not about restricting the flow, it's making the flow legal. Nobody's saying that we shouldn't have immigrants. We're a nation of immigrants. We ought to welcome immigrants. I tell people every day, we need to get on our knees and thank God every day that people are trying to break in this country, not break out. But what we need to do is have an, a front door that we open uh, with people having a way to get here legally rather than to have a front door that's so clogged up with government red tape that people are forced to try to get in through the back door. That's what's created this underground economy. Uh, it's what people are angry about. I don't sense most Americans are upset that people want to come here or that we're a nation of immigrants. But it's really anger, uh, angering to a lot of Americans that it takes more paperwork to get on an airplane in your hometown than it does to get through the international border if you slip through as an illegal.